hi welcome back to my channel and on today's video we're going to talk about the new ipad air that apple is going to be releasing or is rumored that apple is going to be releasing later this year 2025 but before we go into that i want us to quickly look at the previous version which is the m2 ipad air that was released in may 2024 so now for those uh, for the ipad the only change we saw in that device was that it was um, upgraded from m1 to m2 and we have the introduction of the 12.9 inches and 10.9 inches ipad air we all they also have the same design as of that of ipad with the m1 chipset and the ipad pro but another upgrade they added was the introduction of the a14 bionic chipset and they have the same touch id at the top the same face id and another thing that was changed was the camera was changed from the portrait to the landscape design and the same magic keyboard and other accessories just like the previous one and all these things we are expected according to report reaching us that is going to change is going to upgrade um, in this forthcoming ipad air but there will not be too much change according to the report we heard that it's going to upgrade from the m2 to of course the m3 which is more faster in performance and the durability according to report is 30 percent faster cpu than that of the m2 chipset and this is made up of 18 core cpu the, there will not be anything like there will not be any change in the battery setup the battery is going to remain the same according to reports we are getting and the size is still going to remain the same as that of m2 ipad air there might be an introduction of 16 gigabytes of ram from the current 8 gigabytes of ram of course they are going to be and integration of apple intelligence in this new flagship so according to but the bitter thing about the report is that it's still going to retain the 16 head refresh rate instead of an up to upgrade to 120 head refresh rate which is definitely left for the ipad pro and of course it's still going to have its usb the magic keyboard and according to the report it's going to come with wi-fi 7 instead of wi-fi 6e but uh, we don't know for now and of course they are going to be and they are going to be an upgraded magic keyboard in this ipad air so these are the reports we are getting so the difference might not be that much so like what i always recommend is use the one you have until you are just tired of it and maybe you just want to have a fr like to feel something new in your hand but it's still going to be almost the same just with these little little changes that apple is going to make so when other report come out we are also going to push it out here for you to see and please don't forget to like and subscribe on this channel see you in my next video thank you